In this video, we'll be taking a look at three NHL games happening on January 26, 2023, and providing you with free team picks and total picks for each one of those games. So two picks for each game, six picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports. Let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on these three NHL games after fully watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive betting picks to take your sports betting journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer anywhere from one betting pick a day up to 10 betting picks a day and much more. Now let's get started. Buffalo Sabres vs. Winnipeg Jets The Buffalo Sabres face the Winnipeg Jets with both teams having promising seasons. The Sabres have a 25-19-3 record and with four wins in a row have leaped to the middle of the Atlantic Division. The Jets have a 31-17-1 record and with two wins in their last three games are near the top of the Central Division. Both teams look to continue to improve within their respective conferences and the upcoming game looks to be a great one as a result. Buffalo is 4-0 in their last four games overall and 5-1 in their last six games when their opponent allows two goals or less in their previous game while the under is 4-0 in their last four games when their opponent scores two goals or less in their previous game. Winnipeg is 21-6 in their last 27 home games and 10-4 in their last 14 games overall while the under is 18-7-2 in their last 27 games against the Eastern Conference. For the second time in two weeks, the Buffalo Sabres and Winnipeg Jets go to battle. On January 12th, the Jets entered the Sabres building and took home a 4-2 victory. Now the Red Hot Sabres will look to spoil the show for the Jets faithful by stealing a win of their own. On paper, the Jets have a better roster, but they will have their hands full with how well Buffalo has been playing. They are 4-0-1 in their previous five games, which has helped keep them in the hunt for the playoffs. This is a team with low expectations, but you cannot deny how well they have been playing. This is why it is so shocking that the Jets come in as a heavy favorite. They are 3-3-0 in their previous six, which has included tight games to teams much weaker than Buffalo. If the Sabres don't win this game outright, it should stay very close for a majority of the game. There is great value on the Sabres to keep things close, so the Buffalo Sabres to cover the spread as underdogs is our full game side pick. Buffalo has a very good offense, but Winnipeg has a good defense and they have good goaltending. The Jets rank fourth in goals against per game and 14th in shots against per game. Connor Hellebuyck has a record of 23-13-1 with a 2.38 goals against average and a .925 save percentage. Hellebuyck is eighth in goals against average, tied for second in save percentage, and tied for third in shutouts among all goalies in the league. The under has hit in 15 out of 23 home games for Winnipeg this season and the under is 6-4 in the last 10 meetings between these two teams. Winnipeg has the defense and goaltending to slow down Buffalo's high-powered offense. This will be a lower scoring game and the under will hit. Under the projected total is our full game total pick. New Jersey Devils vs. Nashville Predators The New Jersey Devils face the Nashville Predators with both teams heading in opposite directions this season. The Devils have a 31-12-4 record and with back-to-back -back wins have jumped to the top of the Metropolitan Division. The Predators have a 23-18-6 record but have won their last two games to improve in the Central Division. Both teams look to improve in their divisions and the upcoming game should be a good one as a result. New Jersey is 7-1 in their last eight games overall and 0-4 in their last four Thursday games while the over is 5-0 in their last five road games. Nashville is 7-0 in their last seven games against the Metropolitan Division and 4-0 in their last four home games while the under is 5-1 in their last six games following a win. New Jersey has been hot lately, winning seven of their last eight games. The Devils have been excellent on the road this season, with an 18-2-2 road record on the year. However, they have struggled mightily versus the Predators in recent meetings. Nashville is 9-0-1 in their last 10 games against the Devils. The Predators are playing well recently as well, winning four of their last five games. Playing on the road, Nashville defeated New Jersey 4-3 in overtime in the only matchup between the two teams this season in early December. Playing at home, with a lot of success against the Devils, Nashville will win this matchup. So the Nashville Predators' money line is our full game side pick. 
New Jersey has been hot lately, winning seven of their last eight games. The Devils have been excellent on the road this season, with an 18-2-2 road record on the year. However, they have struggled mightily versus the Predators in recent meetings. Nashville is 9-0-1 in their last 10 games against the Devils. The Predators are playing well recently as well, winning four of their last five games. Playing on the road, Nashville defeated New Jersey 4-3 in overtime in the only matchup between the two teams this season in early December. Playing at home, with a lot of success against Against the Devils. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. Philadelphia Flyers vs. Minnesota Wild The Philadelphia Flyers face the Minnesota Wild with both teams looking to improve from rocky seasons. The Flyers have a 20-21-8 record and are near the bottom of the Metropolitan Division while the Wild have a 25-17-4 record and have lost three games in a row. Both teams look to improve in their divisions and the playoff picture and the upcoming game should be a good one as a result. Philadelphia is 1-4 in their last five games against the Central Division and 5-1 in their last six games when their opponent scores two goals or less in their previous game while the under is 5-0-1 in their last six road games. Minnesota is 19-7 in their last 26 games against the Metropolitan Division and 6-2 in their last eight games after scoring two goals or less in their previous game while the under is 7-0-1 in their last eight home games. While these two teams don't match up often, given the Wilds' advantage in net as well as all over the ice, Minnesota have dominated and with a valuable two points up for grabs, which could get them back into a wild card spot, they'll be confident coming into this one. In the past seven head-to-head -head meetings between these two squads, the Wild have a 5-2 record, and with an impressive record at home for Minnesota, they are deservedly are a big favorite. I just don't trust the Flyers goaltending right now as we're seeing a lot more of Felix Sandstrom than I'd like to see if I were a Flyers fan. The Wild haven't been world beaters, but they've had a lot of the recent success between these two teams and are a lot better at home than Philadelphia is on the road. So the Minnesota Wild to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. While neither of these teams possess completely elite, dominant goaltending, the defense is where both of them thrive, especially in head-to-head -head meetings, as the under is 4-1 in the past five matchups with these two squads. For the Flyers, the under is 5-0-1 in their past six games on the road, and with the under for the Wild sitting at 7-0-1 in their past eight games at home, it's safe to say that goals could be few and far between. Under the projected total is our full game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyze. Subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.